to Sweets and Beyond. My name is Aida and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a tomato and avocado salad, also known in some parts of Puerto Rico as gazpacho. Here are the ingredients. Okay, here I have two um, avocados that I um, diced and I keep the pit in here because I don't know why if you keep the pit in there, the avocados won't turn dark. I have two large tomatoes that I chopped up a little bit of cilantro, maybe about two tablespoons, half a cup of olive oil, half a cup of finely diced red onion, and here I'm going to show you. This is Goya salad and vegetable seasoning. It's right here. But I made my own. It just has salt, turmeric, and garlic powder, but this one has MSG and mine does it so I also have I said I don't know if I mentioned half a cup of olive oil and a teaspoon of vinegar these are all the ingredients you need to make the tomato and avocado salad okay so we're going to place the avocado how beautiful and they were so big too I'm gonna place the avocado so you're just gonna basically um, put everything in the bowl in the big bowl how beautiful this looks this is usually served with um, bacalao also. I'm going to put in. But you guys know, if you've been watching my videos, you know that I do not eat bacalao. We're gonna, the teaspoon of vinegar. It's for, to help um, the, t the avocados not to turn brown. I'm gonna be putting in the beautiful olive oil. And we're going to mix it in very gently because we don't want to smush up. <laughs> I use smush. We don't want to smush up the, the avocados or everything. And then I'm going to add, you can either add, if you find it, the Goya salad and vegetable seasoning. Or I just put in half a teaspoon of salt, about a quarter of a teaspoon of turmeric, and half a teaspoon of garlic powder. That is all I did to this. So we're going to sprinkle it around. We are going to add the cilantro. And you're good. just going to mix it in real well, making sure that everything is nice and mixed in. And we're just going to, uh oh, runaway tomato. We're just, just going to cover it, refrigerate it until it's nice and cold. And we'll be back when I get to eat it. Okay, so now it's nice and cold and look how beautiful it looks. My version of avocado and tomato salad or like some people may call it, gazpacho in Puerto Rico only. Um, if you like this video, you know the drill, give it a thumbs up. And after this, there's going to be um, a big box that says subscribe. Click on that if you haven't subscribed. And like I always say, buen provecho, it's so big. And it's typically served in a sandwich, just like this, but um, this is my version of a Boricua bruschetta. Here you go. Mm. Mm. 